Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, I'll show you what to do if you're unable to record audio in Adobe Audition CC. Okay, here we are in Adobe Audition CC. So to start with, if you want to record audio, you need to go into File, New, and Audio File right here. And you can set the sample rates. Usually it's 44100. You can give it a name, Mike. Uh, could be stereo or mono. And the bit depth should stay generally at 32. There we go. Okay, this is a file. And let's hit record. Uh, oh, audition detected a problem with the current audio hardware settings. Okay, uh, record. No, it's a no go. So you have this problem, or maybe it doesn't even throw you any error, but you simply can't record. This is what you need to do. You need to go into the Adobe Audition menu on Mac or the Edit menu on PC and look for Preferences, Audio, Hardware. When you get there, you want to make sure Default Input is selected. At the moment, it's on No Input. So you need to look for your audio interface. Could be your computer's built-in microphone, but I'd suggest use a Pro Mic, uh, an audio interface, a sound card, something like that. For me, it's the Soundcraft Signature 12 MTK. Let's click OK to that. And then, before we start recording, we want to make sure with audio channel mapping over here, we've got it mapped for the right channels. Now for me, I know my mic is coming in on analog one. I've got quite a few channels here. You may well have less, uh, but for me, I'm gonna map channel one to both the left and the right, and then click record. And voila, we have audio, albeit a little bit low in the mix, it's there. That's not a worry. I can then go to favorites, normalize, playback record, and voila. There we go. I've played back my recorded audio. It is working. So remember, if you're unable to record audio, first thing, obviously, before you get to this stage, check all your connections, make sure everything's working, powered up. Sometimes microphones like condensers require phantom power. Uh, so make sure they have that. Otherwise, that might be another reason. And then finally, go into your preferences, audio hardware, make sure the correct input is selected, audio channel mapping, make sure you've mapped those channels correctly, and then I can see no reason why you shouldn't be able to record audio. If you have any questions about this, do post them in the comments down below. Music Radio Creative.com